Hey guys, this is another weekly free instant. I have a great hand, a grape hand. Um, we can game force with this, I think. Yeah, let's game force and then I'll bid hearts. I'll repeat my hearts to show I really have a heart game force. All right, so partner apparently has a singleton heart, <clears throat> three spades, five, five diamonds, four clubs. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, five diamonds. Uh, this is probably just normal. I mean, I don't want to play three no Trump with like four, like king fourth the clubs opposite and have them kill, kill my club suit. And it's it feels likely that they're going to lead it, and I have seven. So, okay, the jack of hearts. I it feels like Jack. Uh, when Gib does this, it's always a singleton honor. So let's keep that in mind. <laughs> uh, I have a diamond finesse to take, and if all else. Fails. I have the spade finesse. If the diamond finesse works, let's see. Oh man. So if East actually has four trumps, I would like to rough down three times. So let's say I win the ace, play club to the ace, rough. Uh, this part's a little tricky. Diamond to the jack, rough a club, diamond to the ace. Rough a club, that's not good enough. Now I can't take the spade finesse. It feels like there's too much I have to do that I, I want to do. And I can't end in dummy to to uh, trump coup east. But I'm going to rough some hearts just because. Or rough some clubs because it feels like the right thing to do. Sometimes you can um, do these things in advance and you can't even really see the benefit. But... In the end, it just turns out to help, even though I know that's kind of dumb, uh, a dumb thing to say. It's like, oh, I don't know how this will help, but sometimes it helps, so I do it. But I don't know. It seems to work for me. All right. Um, I have not seen either club honor. It feels like they're split with both of them. And the diamond king is on side. He had the heart jack. So where is the spade king here? What's going on? Um... So East has three trumps. Uh, I don't. East passed over diamond. I can't read anything into any of this because there's so few high cards anyway. If the spade king is on side, I want to take the finesse. If the spade king is not on side, I want to rough a club. And then hope spades. Uh, hope that East doesn't rough a spade, which means East would have four clubs and two diamonds and four hearts and three spades. It's possible um, because then I can rough a club and then lose a spade and strip spades and then exit a small heart, and East will be end played to lead through lead into my king ten or lead let you know let me finesse basically. Um, but that seems awfully fancy. Playing for the Spade King on side is only one thing I need. Playing for playing for that other thing I re want requires no Spade rough and the Spade offside. And the cards to be lying as I predicted. I don't know. Let's just do this. I That's probably wrong. Okay. Okay, so they're letting me rough anyway. So maybe I will get to this ending anyway. Oh, I did. Oh, he didn't show out. Okay, well, hearts broke 3-2, so I still didn't lose anything, I think. Oh, bad score. Why? Okay, yeah, whatever. I, I can't do anything about that. Six hearts, huh? Yeah, I mean, when diamonds are 3-3, you can make six hearts, sure. Oh, actually, I didn't... Uh, oh, right, because I roughed the diamond later, and then I have no entry. So, anyway. Whatever. That's fine. Uh, 4, 8, 12, 13, 14. I, my heart suit is not very good. Otherwise, I might make the slide over a bit of four hearts if I had better hearts. I, I Well, maybe not. It's hard to say. Ooh, I caught a good hand opposite. Oh, that's funny. I didn't even think about bidding over my partner's four hearts. I mean, he could be stressing. He could. He definitely doesn't need a hand this good, so I'm probably just being ridiculous. Um, uh, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I do have seven hearts, right? I do. Okay. <laughs> it's a good thing I counted. Okay, so with seven hearts, we play for the drop, and it's not working, so... I uh, don't... Oh, maybe I should have roughed the club. Well, I guess if... Yeah, I should have roughed the club and then exited the heart here. And then maybe East would have... To, oh, West would have to... West would be end played, so I've screwed this hand up. Um, but I can still recover, right? Hey, I can still recover. Okay, so we'll do that, and then do that, and then do this. And now he gives me the rough and stuff, so hooray. Okay, I was able to recover, hooray. I ran a very basic end play in spades were 2-2 all along, so it didn't matter. <laughs> Solid 50%. Um, 6, 8, 10, 11, 12, 13. Uh, all right. I mean, let me do the normal thing, I suppose. It feels like I always, well, I don't always get a bad score when I mastermind with Gib, playing best hand tactics, but. Um, can I convince them not to play spades ever? I don't know if you're supposed to bid two hearts with this hand. I'm four triple three with a bunch of soft honors, so I just bid two no trump. I think it's, I, I think it's normal. If not, I think it's defensible. Um. What is the sneakiest thing I can do here? I think the the trickiest thing, I guess, is to put up the king and then maybe East thinks they're running diamonds. I don't see how anything else will help us. Don't shift. I mean, they're going to shift to a spade. Oh, my God. <laughs> I feel like Gib always shifts to a spade here. I mean, dummy is a stiff spade. I don't have four. Okay, so I have seven club tricks. A hard ace is eight and two diamonds is ten. I am not taking this finesse. That is crazy. I'm in a hopeless contract, and I'm going to make it. So let's just make the contract, shall we? That was a stroke of very good luck. I'll show them how bad my uh, spades are. Really rub it in. Oh my god, I almost played a diamond by accident. Okay. Oh, that was a good board. Not surprising. Okay. 10, 13. Oh, the hard king was on side. Did anyone make 5? No. <laughs> How greedy can you get? 10, 13. Kind of a bad 13. I mean, by kind of, I mean it's pretty bad. But it's got 5 hearts. It's got 10s. That's all right. Um, I don't really want to rebid 2 diamonds because my diamonds are so bad. So this worked out. And one no has the benefit that if partner is five, I do have, you know, honor, uh, two honors, so that's nice. I'm going to lose two diamonds and a club and a spade. And I might lose a second two diamonds, a club and a spade, and maybe a second spade. And what else? Um, yeah. I think that's it, actually. So I just have to hope they don't rough anything on me, and I can't afford to do anything tricky. So let's just follow suit. Is he convinced? Did he believe his partner? Yeah, you should believe your partner's carding. When partner plays the king and one, acting like he has king doubleton, uh, showing that he has king doubleton and declare follows queen then jack, don't be fooled, trust your partner. Okay, don't leave another diamond, will you? Oh, man, they're killing me. Uh, I don't think there's really anything I can do about this. My spade slots are so small. Uh, they've played one round of Trump, and East has roughed once. So if East only had two spades, it doesn't matter what I do. If East had three spades, I want to... If I rough with the Queen, I still lose a Trump trick, because West has two spades left. So I think I'm just doomed here. I, I, there's not, My play doesn't matter. I'm going to just lose another trick here. Yeah. I cannot stop it. Oh, wow. Oof. They were breaking very poorly. So, whatever. <laughs> Miserable contract. So, I think it turns out he actually took uh, natural trump tricks, because... Because, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's pretty hilarious. I got a really good score for going down one. Why? Some people went down two, but I didn't do anything. I, I, I really just followed suit. I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay. 8, 10, 12, 13. 
that is Drury or something. What is this? Invite to game. Okay, I don't know. I don't actually play Drury. I don't know what to do over it. It seems like you should be able to use the space efficiently. Like, I could show a short suit game try or something, because I, I really don't know if I want to be in game. Um, forcing a three spades. Yeah, that's great. So, partner has clubs, which is not exciting. So, I would like to stop. It'd be nice. Okay, great. <laughs> It'd be nice to stop in two spades, but I, I don't know. Oh, Jesus. All right, all right, all right. I understand partner's race. Okay, fine. <laughs> And apparently I showed a full opener, so I think once I show a full opener, if you have five trumps and a stiff, you should be game. So he did. So it's cool. that's fine. Um, I have at least one heart loser. I may have two heart losers. It looks like I have to play for the heart jack on side. So two heart losers and a club loser. So this, this is probably going to make. It's all about the heart suit, it seems. Um, and whether or not I want to take this roughing finesse and diamonds it might be free well okay it's not free let's say i play the roughing finesse and i pitch okay let's let's draw trumps first and i'll i'll talk about what i'm thinking about before i started this video i kind of had a mental goal to make this a better video where i talk a little more and not just autoplay which is what i feel like all my videos have been lately okay so if i so East follow with a Diamond King, which already is encouraging because that seems like West has the Diamond Queen. So I can play the Diamond Jack, and if he doesn't cover, I just shake a heart. And now I only have one heart loser. I was thinking if East has somehow false carded, I don't think he has. If I play Diamond, small, pitch a heart, he plays Diamond Queen, then um, this will cost me an over trick if the heart jack was actually onside. So if the heart jack is onside, I want to play the heart to the 10. If the Diamond Queen is on side, I want to run the Diamond Jack. And it, it just seems, I mean, it, it requires East to have false card to trick one, so I don't think he would have done that. So let's just do that. Okay, so good. And now I'm going to make, what, five? Yeah, five. So they, they can take the hard ace. and yeah. Now I don't even need the pitch, but that's not the point. I needed it until that moment. Okay, so even the hard Jack was on side, so everyone's going to make five. That's unfortunate. Okay. 7, 14, 15, 16. This is board 6. Okay. All right. I follow orders sometimes. That is terrible. So I have... Okay. So partner has uh, six spades. Yeah. So yeah, this, this shows five. And this just sets spades as trump, which means partner needs six because I only have... I only promised two. So partner has six spades and he's showing a diamond singleton, which is terrible for me. I only have two spades, which is, you know, I could have three spades or even four spades. So two spades is the minimum. And King Jack opposite a singleton is horrible. It's just the worst wastage you could get. So definitely signing off. Oh, it's the queen. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't blame partner for splintering with the queen. It's just it makes my hand less bad, sort of. But you can see, like, even these the King Jack, these two diamond discards don't serve any purpose for me. Like, partner really wanted my King Jack of Diamonds in the other suits, like the Queen of Clubs or the you know the the Ace King of Diamond Spades, for example. So. So this is fine. We stopped. Uh, we stopped in time. Is there anything I need to do on this hand? I have two diamond pitches and nothing really to do with them. If I could like pitch all my hearts away, then I would to prevent like a rough or something. But um, I can only pitch two hearts, not three. So that's that's no good. So let's just draw trumps as fast as I can. I mean, if I were really paranoid, I could try to finesse the club and then pitch all three of my hearts, but. That seems a little desperate to me. Okay, don't rough. Okay, nobody roughed. Uh, it occurs to me that I should not have blocked the spade suit, <laughs> but it's going to be okay. <laughs> yeah, I mean, as it turns out, my Diamond King is actually useful for the hard pitch, but still, okay. Uh, rank two for doing honestly not much. Well, I stole three no, but I didn't do anything. At least uh, this video, I talked a little more. I felt like this might be a better video. This might be a pass out board. Yep. Okay. So forty percent. I'm not gonna open that piece of cheese. So uh, two no shows the miners really. Holy moly. Um, I've never held a hand this good opposite an unusual two no. I mean, I know he doesn't have my standards, but still, what, what do I, uh, the law, game support, that's stupid, um, 
I'm terrified. Uh, yeah, I, I'm just terrified. Full stop. Hmm. If they don't, if we have a heart weakness, they have to lead it too. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So you can see, I, I mentioned, if we have a heart weakness, they have to lead it. I was hoping they would lead a spade, and even if we were off two cashing hearts, we would be able to. Um, we would be able to just. Uh, claim claim the slam also my partner could have the hard ace or my partner could have a heart singleton so there are a lot of chances for us to make the slam the important thing i think is that we have 12 tricks I, it's more important for me that we have 12 tricks than than not being off two top losers because if we're off two top losers they have to find it first right they may not have a second chance and if we don't have 12 tricks well maybe you control every suit but you don't have 12 tricks so anyway i i really thought my bid was a i thought it was a good bid so, all right. Hope you guys got something out of that.